Hi, I'm Ray Clark. I'm a paediatric ENT surgeon at Alderhey in Liverpool and with John Watkinson I'm joint editor-in-chief of the forthcoming edition of Scott Brown. Hi, my name's John Watkinson. Well, I was editor of the paediatric section of the previous edition under the editorship of Mike Gleeson and Mike handed over to John Watkinson but John thought it, uh, joint editors would have been a good plan and he approached me and I've been very proud to have completed the task. I've been involved in three editions of Scott Brown now. The first one that I was involved with was the sixth edition in the mid-90s when I was a, a chapter author and the next time I was involved was the seventh edition which came out in 2007 and I was the editor of the new plastics edition. So this edition I'm now senior editor with Ray Clark. It's bigger, totally comprehensive, reflects a multidisciplinary approach, it's well researched, well written, well illustrated and it covers all aspects of ENT with regards to endocrine surgery, plastic surgery, skull-based surgery, nasal surgery, and head and neck and reconstruction. As well as developments in surgery, there have of course been developments in, in the publishing industry and it's now far more visually attractive than it was. It's beautifully laid out, it's colour-coded, and the illustrations I think are perfectly beautifully reproduced with high quality artwork. And we've incorporated learning features such as key points, clinical practice points, We've asked every author to comment on future direction of travel, his or her especially. So even glancing through it, I think there's lots of ways in which readers can learn and absorb the information very quickly. It's extremely comprehensive. It covers, I think, pretty much the whole of the specialty of otolaryngology, and it reflects many of the changes that have come about in the last few years, particularly in head and neck surgery. For example, we've got a very large section on thyroid and parathyroid surgery. There's a substantial section on skull-based surgery. The paediatric section has been completely revamped. In fact, virtually every chapter has been newly written. And it's also beautifully produced and illustrated. And I think readers will find it much, much easier to navigate than previous editions. Medicine still remains one of the greatest and most rewarding degrees to have in the world. As surgeons, we operate on our patients, but it's not just the operation. It's the understanding and passing on the knowledge, research, operative skills, as well as the understanding of the multidisciplinary setting. My message to the surgeons of today is keep your knowledge skills up, train well, travel, and do a fellowship. Look for a subspecialty, set standards, and then develop your skills. <laughs>